One of the first feature requests that I received when I launched Obsidian X Draw back in April last year was to add the option for a fourth font. I held back on this request for a long time because I was afraid of losing backwards compatibility. In the meantime, I learned quite a lot about how Excolidraw works, and I see that this risk is not so high after all. And now with some help from the community, I have this new feature in Excolidraw available. By default, the feature is going to be turned off. So you need to go to settings, to Excolidraw, and you need to go down to experimental features. And here at the bottom, you will see enable fourth font option. It is turned off by default because you will lose some of the platform independence when you turn this on. Your drawings will no longer look exactly the same when you open them in xcolidraw.com. They will still open, but the fourth font will not look the same. Also, this is a single font for your entire vault. So if you save a file with the font and then you change the font, the way that file looks will change as well. In the end, I think this is not so much an issue. You can set your fourth font that you really love and then you can stick to it and this is going to work. So you need to set or turn this feature on and then you need to select a font file. By default, you will only see Virgil available on the list and the other files you need to download and install into Obsidian. So how do you do that? In my case, I've downloaded these files to the fonts folder. So I created a folder in my vault called fonts and I placed these font files here. To display the files, you may need to go to files and links and you may need to select detect all file extensions. Otherwise, Obsidian only displays files that it recognizes and font files by default it doesn't. And then once you have this enabled, you have your fonts directory. You can go to a website like, for example, fonts.google.com and you can select the font you want. So let's say uh, I would like to use this font in my vault and in my drawings. So I can click on this font and click download font family. And when the download is ready, then you will need to uh, unpack the file. So let me just unpack it and let's look for the folder. So this here's the, the font file itself. So what I need to do with this font is I need to drop this into Obsidian into my fonts folder. The font has appeared and then I can go to settings, Excolidraw. I can scroll down here and you see the font has appeared. And when I select the font, then from then on, I'm using this font in Excolidraw. And that's about it. I hope you will enjoy this new feature. I'm very excited that I finally can provide this feature based on all those requests. Thank you.